Hello, I'm Andrew Smith from Treescape Certified Arborist. Thanks for joining us for this week's edition of the Green Review. Now, in the past, we've talked about the value of trees with respect to the many benefits uh, that these trees will give us. Today, we're going to talk about the actual nominal value that trees possess. And joining me today is, uh, is, is Paul Hambidge, a certified consulting arborist with Treescape, uh, to, to help us understand uh, the value of trees and the whole process of plant appraisal. Now, Paul, what exactly do we mean by plant appraisal? Well, plant appraisal, um, Andrew, just purely means that we undertake an evaluation of the tree and we produce a monetary valuation. That's in dollars. Okay. Now, as a homeowner, why would I consider doing something like this? Well, there's a number of reasons for doing it. You may want to value your real estate quite accurately, um, so include the landscape in it. But very often it's done for insurance purposes and usually it's done after damage, although primarily it should be done before. Okay, so it sounds like it can be a very useful tool. Uh, how would you go about doing one of these valuations? Well, there's, uh, the, the main method that's used in North America um, is uh, undertaken by the Council of Tree and Landscape Appraisers. Um, and there are a number of methods within the guide they produce, but the one that we use is, is called the trunk formula method. Okay. Now, just in, in behind us here is, a, is a, a quite a nice uh, honey locust tree that really stands out as a nice prominent landscape feature on this front yard. Um, how would you calculate the value of this particular tree using the methods that you've talked about? Well, there's four things we need to know about, Andrew. There's species, there's size, there's condition, and there's location. Okay. Now, species is fairly straightforward if we know our trees. The size we measure a diameter at what we call breast height, that's about 1.4 metres off the ground. And then we look at its general overall condition, that's what I mean by evaluation. Um, and then we look at the location, the suitability of the tree, if you like, um, to its setting, um, how well it complements the, the houses around it. Okay, now how much of this information would be subjective? Or, or is there figures that, uh, that is just absolute raw data that goes into these uh, calculations? Yeah. Well, well, the species rating is undertaken um, by a committee which decides how suitable a particular species is for Ontario. Okay. Um, the size is, is pretty much fixed once we've measured that. Um, and there are a number of other criteria that go up to make um, condition and obviously location. But they are subjective, but we can be fairly objective about them. Very good. Now, I know earlier in the day you took the time to, to do an assessment on this tree. And uh, now, just out of curiosity, what was the value of this particular honey locust? Well, this particular tree behind us, Andrew, um, I valued approximately at $1,400. $1,400, wow. Yeah. So, in addition to providing some really great benefits to our property, they really can literally be a true asset to our property, something well worth uh, maintaining over the long run. Absolutely, yes. And don't forget that you've paid for the plant in the nursery and it keeps appreciating in value. So it's a real asset. So that dollar's only going to go up in the future. Absolutely, yeah. Well, thanks very much for joining us again today, Paul. It's always a pleasure having you on the show. Thank you. And that's all the time we have for today's Green Review. Here's your point to ponder. Aside from nominal values, trees can provide valuable information about their history. The tree rings can provide precise information about environmental events that have impacted the tree over its course of development, including such things as drought, floods, and even volcanic eruptions. Although we don't have to worry about that around here, it's certainly a point of interest. Until next Friday, I'm Andrew Smith. The Green Review is brought to you by Treescape Certified Arborists. We bring trees to life.